Welcome back to the Dividend Stacker Investing Channel. Today, we're going to talk about how I'm all in on YOLO call options. Well, technically they are. I am all in on call options. It's like 90, 95% of my portfolio is in call options. But let's just see how it goes. Today, we're um, pretty much flat. The index says we're pretty much flat except for the Dow. On the last week, we're up 23%. On the last month, we're up 53%. The last three months, up 76%. And year to date, we are up 144% or 135,000. With the Dow up 5%, NASDAQ up 48%. That's pretty crazy. And S&P up 20%. Now, we can go down and look at my portfolio. My portfolio is mostly just Robinhood call options and SoFi call options. While I do have 107 shares of Palantir, all the money's in Hood and SoFi. If we look, I have 148 contracts of the January 2025. What was it? January 2025, $20 call options. As you can see, today I'm up 6%, but altogether I'm up 94% on this Robinhood call option on the app Robinhood. Now we can go to my SoFi, $15, 2020, January 2025 call. It has a market value of 193000 Today we're up 2% or 5,000, but all together we're up 54% or 68,000. Man, call options have really saved this portfolio this year. 2022 was such a bad year, but I saw the market moving up so crazy. Had to put some call options and eventually we're going to have to sell these and just move it back to long-term investments. I do have some PayPal call options in another account. I think PayPal is going to do really good, but that's neither here nor there. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time on the Dividend Stacker Investing Channel.